How many bones in a skeleton? Cause in a human there's a hella ton. 206 bones make up its frame. So let's pull them out, name by name. You might think the skull is just one bone, but trust me when I say that it's not alone. The cranium, the face, and the inner ear, 29 whole bones are found in here. A baby skull hardens well into the future. Secure and firm joints to form the sutures, the occipital, parietals, and sphenoid view, the cranial temporals, and the ethmoid too. Mandible and maxilla offer quite a bite. The lacquer moles and zygomas give your eyes a sight. Nasals, palatines, bomber up in the nose. Nate's filter breaths to ensure air flows. The hyoid bone sits atop the neck. No joints to its name to help keep it in check. Malleus, incus, stapes in the ear. Tiny ossicles, without them you can't hear. Radius, ulna, up to the humerus. Down to the thigh, cause that's where the femur is. You call it kneecap, I say patella. The tibia is slapped right next to the fibula. 24 ribs emerge from the backbone. 10 flow with cartilage, cause they lack stone. 14 ribs hook up with the sternum. Diphoid body and the manubrium. 7 are cervical, 12 are thoracic. Build up the spine, see how you can stack it. The last five vertebrae join in the lumbar, the bottom is where the coccyx and sacrum Ilium, pubis, ischium, pelvis, the hips and the booty, you can shake it quite well since the clavicle and scapulae round off the torso and we're not done, there's a hundred bones more, so... Let's break it down like an osteoclast. We got hammock, capitate, trapezium, scaphoid, pisiform, lunate, troquet, trim, and trapezoid. We just did the carpals, now let's head onto the tarsals. Navicular, cuneiforms, cuboid, talus, the heel in the back is called calcaneus, five metacarpals, five metatarsals, flanges on top, I call that a handful. Some bones are alone, some come in pairs, some combine into one, one spot they share, and now that everything's said and done, there's 206 bones in the skeleton.